Boer.com. Yeah, very bored. Well, we know that, obviously. What are we meant to do? I don't know. Um, hmm. Is there anything going on? Uh, other than I signed you up for the most beautiful penguin in the world. Wait, what? Yeah, I, uh, I signed you up for this a few, um, I'd say it was a few weeks ago. Um, why didn't you tell me? Because uh, you're too busy dealing with Chuck being away, you're griefing. Yeah, well, hmm, I, I know what you mean. So, how's life without Chuck? Yeah, it's sad. Hmm, is it? Well, it's a shame, but you have to welcome, are you, are you... Da your new stepdad into the family. Come on, welcome him. Hello. Hello, Dad. That's fake. I'm sorry, I'm not fake. I'm your stepdad and you just got to get used to it. It makes more sense a dog being your dad rather than a, a bird being your dad, doesn't it? Yeah. So, I think, well, you do know I'm adopted. Tell me we're blimmin' adopted. Now she's even less to do with me. Ah, well, things happen. Um, you don't possibly think that... You don't possibly think that she was in an orphanage? Oh, no, 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 it's a completely different story. Uh, my ex-boyfriend, she lived in, where was it, Florida? And my ex-boyfriend was going into Florida because he's a criminal. Oh no, why were you with him? See, he didn't, he, was, he wasn't a criminal until we broke up. Ah, uh, see now. So, mm, well, how long were you together? Five years. Oh, so how was this? He was on a holiday to Florida and then he took a cookie and he tried to kill her. Oh, so we had found her because at the same time would to evaporate to America because they were saying that media was meant to hit Antarctica but that never happened. And yeah, we moved to Florida for no reason. Here we are, we're still here. I miss Antarctica. Yeah, especially because Florida's a hot environment. I know what you mean. Uh, yeah, I do. I, I miss Florida. What does Bella think? Bella was never in Florida. Bella's... Bella's actually my sister, you know. Oh, could you not have told me already? Well, things happen. But, oh crap, I forgot. I'm on for the most beautiful woman in the world. Wait, when was this? Um, I've been signed up for it. And the results are coming in tomorrow. Oh my goodness, uh, what are we going to do? Uh, uh, it's 7am. That means the results are ready in. Oh no. Um, welcome to this year's results for the most beautiful lady. I am your host. A rip-off of, oh, what's that man's name? Uh, yeah, I'm just, you can just call me random man. And today I have to tell you the most beautiful woman is in the world and who is most likely to appear in Love Island in a few months and decide to break someone's heart. Because all she is is full of plastic. So, before we find out who the next lady is to partake in Love Island, although we're just guessing, I would also like to say how, how, we go. We have four composers. The uh, the sorry. I'm. I shouldn't have got my job. We have four participants. We have Penny, 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 and Penny. So it doesn't seem like it's a much tough competition because it. Uh, it's a twenty five percent chance of being Penny, twenty five being Penny, twenty five being Penny, and twenty five being Penny, which basically means it's a hundred percent chance of being Penny. Out of our four participants. So the winner is Penny. How could we have guessed? Or there is Aunt Penny, but Aunt Penny hasn't got her surgery, so she's not good looking. But Penny's our beauty queen winner of the year. Yay! Woo! Where's my robe? Um, we have a blanket. Is this good enough? Oh, yes. Look at me, most beautiful woman in the... Oh, 
I'm not so hot in here. I'll do this. Oh, wait, do not bring up those racist things. Uh, sorry, sorry. Um, get, get that off me. Uh, do I look better now? Much better. Yes, I'm, I'm late for the show. Um, so I won. What do, do I get any money? You get 50,000 pounds. Oh, 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 oh. Uh, right, you can calm down because by the time we have, by the time we put taxes on, that'll be a bit of grand. Right. Um. So I'm gonna speak to Siri about it because I haven't got any friends. Sorry. Oh, that's a she. And what about um? What about fishy? Oh yes, fishy. Sorry. Uh. Right. How do you speak to Siri on this thing? Right. It's got to be here somewhere. Right. Speak to Siri. Oh. So, I have to tell her about the prize. Right, it should be here somewhere. Right, hello Siri. Hi, Siri here. Um, I have a question for you. Yes. Um, what breed is my dog, Bella? She seems to think that she is a red setter. Sorry, there is no breed for that name. A what? Do they not know what a red setter is? Red setter. You must mean Irish setter. No, I. I said red setter. Thank you very much. Thank you. Irish setter it is. R red. Irish. Rayed. 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 She didn't speak at the same time, me. It's so predictable. Red. Setter. Oh, she's gone silent. Maybe she's getting it. Irish setter. Oh my goodness, this thing is completely pointless. Right, um, right, we'll just turn it off. Right, there, get rid of it. Right, oh crap, it's nearly seven o'clock. Oh, we spent so much time on Siri, I forgot about my interview. Hello and welcome to the six o'clock news. I'm your substitute host today due to the fact that our host is a gayest on tonight's show. So on the six o'clock news, what we're going to be talking about, the coronavirus is sweeping around the world, a deadly disease that is killing everyone. Other, uh, in other news, the PlayStation PS5 is consoling is coming up close. So, for anyone who's interested, uh, the Brexit is going to be happening on Friday, and they can't get themselves out of it. Uh, Taylor Swift and Ariana Grande are looking to win the Grammys. Uh, Love Island's con eliminated. Um, oh, Madonna has cancelled her first show. And a whole lot of other rubbish, basically. And the royal use, uh, Megan and Harry are leaving. And any use in the gaming world? Not much. Other than the fact that... Other than the fact that Fortnite Season 2 is delayed by two weeks. And in the music world, it's been pretty gammy with music recently. So that's you filled up to date with your use. Right. Now we're going to have a guest on the panel. Right, so please welcome this year's Beauty Queen winner, Penny Penguin. Anywhere to be seen? Anywhere? Hmm. What are we going to do? Oh, uh, I might as well just turn up now, don't you think so? Uh, let me try. Hello! What kept you so long? Oh, wait. I was just, I'm just a little bit late. A little bit's an under-exaggeration. I just, sorry. 
I'm just, I'm, I'm, you know, typical woman. I'm late. You know, all women are late. I'm sorry I tried. Uh, well, it's normal in the average woman's time of getting to stuff. Uh, thank you. Uh, so, winner of this year, Beauty Queen. How's it feel? Oh, it feels beautiful. I just I missed it. Now, you missed it and I'd like to kick you off the show. Hang on a minute. What do you want? You do not have a business license. You cannot produce this show because you do not have a qualified business license. Hmm, I've been caught. So, that means from the FBI of me, you are under arrest for hosting a show without a business license. Ah, so, tie your handcuffs. Jack the jail. I don't have a business license. Oh, I shouldn't say anything. Do you have a business license, ma'am? Oh, yes, I have a business license. I've had it for the whole six o'clock news history. Right, you're under arrest. Oh. Right, everyone, six o'clock news is over for today. Hang on a minute. Who killed Cookie? Um, Bella.